Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Nate here, and I finally gotten my hands on the iPhone 4S. Just got home, home from school a couple of minutes ago, and I've been waiting in anticipation to unbox this thing all day. So unfortunately, the uh, packaging did open up a little bit, I guess, during shipping, but nonetheless, we'll go ahead and dig in. So I did go ahead and purchase the 16 gigabyte white model for AT&T. And taking a look at the box here, got the iPhone 4S symbol, uh, logo right there and the Apple logo, and there's also an iCloud sticker right here on the bottom. So let's go ahead and open it up. And we've got the iPhone 4S sitting on top. We'll go ahead and set that to the side. And underneath we'll probably have the standard Apple documentation. Let's see what we've got here. We've got the fingertips, uh, iPhone 4S, and of course, Apple stickers. And then, of course, we've got the Apple charger, 30-pin dock connector, and the usual crappy Apple headphones. So let's go ahead and see if we can power on the iPhone 4S for the first time. So I'm going to go ahead and set this down, and then we'll take a look when it's turned on. All right, so now that I have the phone powered on, I'll go ahead and walk you through the personal setup. So we'll choose English, United States. We'll enable location services, connect to a Wi-Fi network, and I'm going to go ahead and restore my iPhone from an iCloud backup. So the one that I had made from my uh, iPhone 4, we'll go ahead and put that on my iPhone 4S. So now that I'm signed in, we can go ahead and select the latest backup I have made from my iPhone 4, choose Restore, and we'll wait for this process to finish up. So it looks like the iCloud Restore was successful. So this has been an unboxing and personal setup of the iPhone 4S. Be sure to check back in throughout the day as I'll have many more videos coming up with this device. Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like it, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.